So I have, I have questions for the three of you, but we will start with Kathleen. What's it like to pass the torch to Diana and be Dora? It's amazing and overwhelming, um, emotional. Uh, just to even be a part of the Dora family again is such a full circle moment for me. And um, to pass it on to such amazing, amazing people like Diana and Asher are doing amazing. I remember when I first heard their voices, um, I, I got so emotional. I almost started to cry just because you feel like the the magic that I remember feeling when Dora first started and I'm just so excited for everyone to watch it and to be able to feel that. Um, those who grew up with me and who want to share that with their kids now and their families, I think it's going to be so, so special. And for you, Diana, what was it like to now take on Dora and the representation of it? I mean, it's amazing. I mean, it felt really great to be cast um, as this big of a show. I mean, I've never done anything like it and it feels like such an honor to be part of it. And I mean, I know Dora is like so important to so many people because I mean, she like represents a bunch of uh, Latina, Latino people like me. Um, you know, she's part Mexican and Cuban and Peruvian. And, you know, that's not something you see a lot. So I'm very glad that um, Dora is, um, is coming back. And for you, Usher, you, what's it like for you to be a part of it? What was Dora for you growing up? Um, well, uh, well, whenever I was growing up, like, Dora was, like, a fun show that I could always, like, watch whenever I'm going to bed. It was really fun, and, uh, and, uh, it's such an honor and to be Boots, and I, whenever I, I was auditioning for I didn't even know it was Dora the Explorer I was auditioning for. I was, thought I was going to be playing for the role of Bobby and Amazing Emma, but whenever I was on, like, my first or second, uh, like a uh, uh, what do you call it? Like a uh, callback. Um, uh, like that's when I found out that that's Dora the Explorer, and I'm Boots. So I was like really happy, and it's such an honor, and it's it's so fun, and I it's, it's amazing. So, are you picking up on some Spanish words? Um, I know some of the basics, like uh, azul. Rojo and Amarillo, and I know Hola, Gracias, and Amigos, and all that. You are adorable. I, I just have <laughs> to say, and I'm sure everyone else agrees with me. Yes. <laughs> now, Kathleen, you come in as mommy. Can you talk a little bit about her? Yeah, um, I think we see a lot more of mommy this time around, and I think it's really exciting. Um, and like Diana had mentioned before, you know, Dora now is multicultural. So her mom is Peruvian, um, which is close to my heart because both of my parents are from Peru. Um, and Dora's dad now is Mexican and Cuban. So having that multicultural background, I think, is important um for the u.s latinos to relate to um because a lot of us have a multicultural background and that's something that dora always you know the show did for the latino community they it was that representation that we needed um and yeah i, I think mommy is just gonna you know she's young she loves to you know be a part of dora and boots's adventures or well, you know, loves to know like what they're doing and loves to like be a part of it. So it's going to be really fun to see mommy, um, you know, in this, in this new, in this new light. So I'm excited. And I like that it's also for adults. I remember watching Be Introduced to Dora when I had my little brother. He's not yeah. so little anymore, obviously, <laughs> but and watching it with him. So what, what's, what are your thoughts that adults also get to get to enjoy? Well, I mean, Dora is like like you said, it's for adults. It's for everyone, really. Um, I love the fact that Dora is not only just like a fun show, but it's also very educational, and it can teach uh, so many people new words that they didn't know before, and it can also teach people about new cultures that maybe they weren't so familiar familiar with. And I think that's something anyone can learn at any age. Um, I think yeah, I think the you know parents 
they relate to Dora too because of you know it's just so awesome the energy of the show the music is incredible I think that's one of the things where when you just listen to it you just your shoulders start moving like you just want to start dancing singing the songs um the lines are iconic like you know saying swipe or no swiping probably with your little brother or your little cousin is this is so fun you know <laughs> so it, there's just a lot of fun elements that include both the parent or the adult and the child to do together um that i think is what brings the two together and have like such a fun time watching the show well thank you for bringing more memories to more people and <laughs> congratulations thank you you're welcome thank you bye-bye